I've been with FedEx for six years now. And it just shocks me that in 2024, I'm still being told that there are certain towns that I can't deliver in. And when I ask why, they say they're sorry um, that people are the way they are, but I can't deliver there. And it was crazy because when I first started in 20... I first started at FedEx in 2018 and my supervisor there, I was in Springfield, Illinois, and she told me like, you can't go there. And I was like, huh? She's like, you can't go there. And I, I, I ain't too much think of it. And so I was delivering one day in a different town and I had um, a late pickup. So I had a few hours to spare. So I'm like, I'll just drive over to the next town. It's like 12 minutes away. I'm like, I'll just go to the Walmart. You can always kill time at Walmart. I drive over to the Walmart, I walk in, and the looks I got made me immediately turn around, go back to my truck and drive, you know, a little 12, 13 minutes back to the town that I was in. And I parked in an abandoned parking spot, and I just sat in that abandoned parking spot for like two and a half hours. And yeah, she's like, I'm sorry, but that's just the way they are. And then when I went to Wisconsin, I was cool. I always delivered to the rural areas, but then I had a guy, you know, talk to me crazy, like, just real crazy. Anywho, and now I'm here, and it's a route that I can't do because I'm black. And it's not because I can't do the route, it's because of how the people in that town act or how past drivers how drivers have been treated in that town um the same color as me so now they just stick to putting people in that town that look like those people and that's so crazy because it's 2024 it's so crazy but yeah it's crazy